Hey, welcome back. I'm Carlton with Put My Poor Barbecue. And as most of you know, I got that new Z Grill 700D pellet smoker in and been running through the paces. And about the only thing I could find that I wish it had was a pellet dump. So I could dump the hopper and change out flavor of the pellets or, or just empty the pellets out while it's not being used. Well, I figured out a fix for that. And today I'm going to show you how to add uh, a new hopper to it with the pellet dump. It's a real cheap fix. It's less than $50. So come on, let's go do it. Okay, the first thing you're going to want to do is you want to get out all the pellets that you can before you take this off. So I'm just using a scoop here to try to clean out all these pellets. I've got a grill down here that a grate about halfway down that you got to remove. Okay. All right, I got those pellets out. I'm gonna set these right over here for right now. Let me run and get some tools right quick and I'll be right back. First thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take this loose here. Now we're gonna take the top of the hopper off. Can't do that, we're gonna to have to take this off first. Let's see if I can get this back in there now. So it's out of the way, so I can pull this off. And you wanna make sure that the power is off. Now let's see if that'll just slide right off. See if we slide. Okay. I've got me a mess going here. I have to sweep these up. Okay, we're gonna set this right over here. See if I can slide this sucker back up on there. Okay, just so everybody knows. You'll have to re-drill two holes. This one's two and an eighth inch from the bottom. And this one is three inches from the top to mount this on. All the other holes should line up fine. Uh, we're fixing to, fixing to get it finished up. But as you can see, it's got the, in here, it's got the pellet dump. And we've already got the lid and everything mounted on it, mounted on direct. That's the only, that's the only four holes that I can find that I had to re-drill. Same thing on the back. Had to re-drill them. This is your, this is your pellet dump right here, as you can see. And it just dumps the pellets out right there. And this is a this is the hopper for a Gorilla Grill Silverback. That's exactly what that is. It's basically the same thing. So I'm going to go ahead and finish getting this put together, and we'll get it fired up. To see how it works. Now we're going to mount this bottom plate back on here. This cover plate. We get the screws started in it. They should line up just fine. Let's get the other one started in here. Let me go around the other side, get these two started in. Okay. Now that we gotta get these two screws right in here. these all tightened up okay now then let me get this little control panel back on okay hey 
that's it took me about 30 minutes now we're gonna get this fired up and I'll be right back with you okay well there's the upgrade for the um, Z grill uh, you can just buy that extra that extra hopper that's got the clean out for under $50 and other than drilling four small holes 732 holes in it to mount it everything else screwed right together it's that simple and you can convert it over and you'll have a dump for your on your pellet hopper it took me about 30 35 minutes in total to do it all so thanks a lot for joining me i hope this helped you out if it did leave me a comment down there if you learned anything leave me a comment down there be sure and hit the subscribe button if this is your first time here because i'm always coming out with tips and tricks on smokers and recipes so be sure and hit the little bell next to us so you're notified every time that I come out with a new video. And I want to send a special thanks out to all the men and women in the military that are serving around the world. And I want to send a special thanks out to all the men and women in law enforcement that protect and keep us safe every day. Thank you very much.